Okay, here's the phone. I'm waking up the phone. Down here we can put it into phone mode, internet mode. This is going into settings. This is people. This is camera. We're going to start by going into phone mode. We have a list up here at the top, speed dial, recent phone calls, and contacts. It shows here the most recent people I have called. It's easy for me to call one of them back. These dots down here are for the telephone keypad. I come in here to the keypad and I dial my number, 1-310-394-5555. I hit the green button and I dial. If I make a mistake, I hit the X and back up and get out of the number. I can go back and now I'm back in regular phone mode. I can make a dial call to you. I can call Rachel. I'm going to click on Recents and it will show me the recent calls that I have made and it's easy to redial one of those people. The symbol will call red. I have missed a call from you. Gunter called me three times. I missed a call from you and then I called you back. If I go into contacts, these are all the contacts from your Gmail account. And you can send people emails or phone calls directly from here. Let me show you what your card looks like for instance. And I've got your home number, your mobile number, your email, and a note about your neighbor. And if I go in here to the dots, that's the menu, and I can see more stuff. I'm going to go back. And I'm back at the main screen of the telephone. From here, I can take a picture. I can go into the camera. And right now, I'm looking at the tiles in my kitchen and I can rotate it and take a picture going the other way. Now I'm taking a picture of myself and I can show you something. I can also take a movie with the camera. I'm going to turn the camera back around and we're going to take a picture. There the picture is taken. I'm back to the home screen of the phone now. Now let's go look at the internet browsing and I can go to www.ucla.com and that's really easy. If you want to bookmark a page you come up here to the menu and you say you want to bookmark the page and we can go into Gmail. This is my Gmail app here. This is what most people use for Gmail. It's showing without me even looking the latest calls. If I click on it, it will show you these are the most recent emails that have come in from people. Besides the inbox, I can click up here on the menu and I can go into the outbox and the scent and the drafts and the spam and the trash and all this other stuff that we don't need to go into right now. Let me go back. If I want to write, you see the little symbol here for compose. I go into compose. If I start typing somebody's name, it will auto-complete and I can say test and it will correct my spelling and I can say test message. I'm going to spell it wrong and notice it's offering to spell it correctly and I click on the little triangle up here to say like a paper airplane to say send. You could also click on the paper clip to send something with an attachment. Test. Now I need the number two. If I come down here in the corner this gives me a choice of other stuff like the two and then I go back to ABC mode attached junk okay now I click on the paper clip it says what do you want to attach and I guess I want to attach oh let me attach this picture here sure why not 
Okay, that's from Angkor Wat. So I'm now going to send you the picture. Now, if you take a picture from your camera, the pictures from your camera get stored in your gallery. You see over here, gallery. And I can elect to send a picture to you. So let's say I want to send this picture to you of the girls with the cats. I could hit the trash can and delete it. This symbol right here means share. That symbol right there. So it says, how do you want to share it? I want to share it with my Gmail. And I'll send you the picture, P-E-K. And I say pick. And I say attached. And then I hit the paper airplane symbol to send. And it will have sent the picture. And that was taken yesterday. And I have all these other pictures in here. I can access my Google Drive. I can access my Dropbox. I can access all my files. I have an Adobe PDF reader. We have, I can pay for my parking spaces. There's the Gmail app. We have all this stuff here. I have automatic photo backup turned on, and I have Skype, and Skype is very nice for making phone calls. And I have some cute little games on here too, and a little square dance program. So, that's the phone. And I'm going to stop now and send you the video.